Many teachers ask how to add more assessment types. So the gradebook starts with six. Um, if you don't need all six, you can just hide a column, for example. Um, but if you want to add more, this is what you do. Um, you want to add a column uh, for another assessment type somewhere in the middle. So don't add one. Uh, don't don't go and insert a column here. Uh, preferably, uh, make sure you're somewhere in the center and insert another column. And so we'll just call this another another type uh, three for example um, and so what happens is after you've done that uh, you can notice that in a drop down for example uh, you will have the next assessment type um, it doesn't automatically usually fill with the formulas so what I like to do um, you can you can just select select these and put your cursor over on the bottom right and drag such that um, now you have the formulas and just to check Instead of calling this homework, this is assessment type 3. Now it shows up, and it shows up just fine. Um, you will notice that the grades aren't appearing right here. So what I want to do is I select these two rows, I unhide them for a second, and I just simply have to drag all these formulas over, um, and that will make it so that they show up with the graphs. And then I can go and I can rehide this. So far that's good. I want to make sure I add in whatever percent these will be. So if I make this 10%, it's going to tell me there's there's an error. It doesn't add up to 100, which is what it ideally should be. So I can adjust as needed. The only next step that I need to do is I need to go to the printouts, if I'm going to use the printouts, and I want that other assessment type. So right now we have uh, one, more, one more type that's not showing. So I'm just going to insert a row um, above and I will uh, make sure the numbering on the side uh, lines up and this is 18 and now it should be 19 and now this is this is starting to work these do not that like this row that I've added doesn't have formulas this one does so uh, it's a little tricky I'm gonna select almost all of the cells in this row and just drag them down so now they all show up very nicely um, but this is a little troubling these are merged and so Excel tends to have trouble, uh, sometimes has trouble uh, like inserting and dragging down. If you're having any trouble, you can just unmerge them for a second um, and drag down. But in this case, in this case, it mainly worked um, and now it's printing out correctly. So that's how to add extra assessment types uh, to the gradebooks.